Hey you guys, welcome back. Thank you for tuning in to another video. And this is going to be Let's Build a Number 4. I almost forgot. and we, We're only been 3 in. Darn it. 3 in. So this one's going to be a little bit different. This time we are going, as you can tell, I'm, I'm sitting at my desk with a computer. And um, this time we're going to spend a little more time trying to find a car uh, uh, other than um, spending most of it in building it so it's gonna be a little bit more uh, cut up and shortened up actually it might be the same length but this time I don't know what car I want to build so we're gonna go ahead and begin looking this time we are going let's take a look at South um, Andreas superautos.com whatever it's called and let's just take a look and go down the list and see not sure exactly what budget I have uh, I might even who knows we might even do a freaking million dollar car today who knows we're just gonna look and whatever I decide is what we're gonna do so uh, this one is pre-recorded so if you did suggest a video on the last episode um, I will get to it if not then we're just gonna keep going I'm not sure yet because this is the same day so let's see what kind of car we want to build uh, one of these days I or one of these episodes I wouldn't mind building this car right here the super sport um, but we, who knows we might even build it today we might even build it today but I want to find something fun something fun I mean they're all gonna be fun but you know just take a look and one of these days the NASCAR would be cool uh, so I built what two so an off-road two cars so we could do a bike we could do a bike I think I'd done one before. I think it was the zombie chopper. Can't remember. I can't remember. I've built so I think I have like 60 vehicles now. I don't even know. Too many. But I uh, haven't done any pre runners yet. I do have this truck in already, but it's a fun build. And I think I have the best color scheme. So, so far, I'm not finding. I mean, I did see a few. I pointed out that I would like to build but I think we can go ahead and check out the uh, legendary and see if we can find anything in there and we actually I mean there's a lot of vehicles I want to build in here just not sure like this one I want to build um, I do want to buy another supercar but I don't know if I want to do it this early into the series because if I do it then it's going to limit us on what we buy in the next few episodes you know what I mean so I do like I don't know I have driven this car as it's when it was fully upgraded I don't really care for it I, I, I like the look that they were going for but I don't really care for it so I don't know and I'm kind of going to stick away in this series unless I grind it out um, stick away from the two million dollar cars because I mean the money's gonna, the money's gonna go quick if I do that and then the cars will just get cheaper which isn't really a bad thing don't really have to spend a bunch of money but um, honestly the vapid hustler looks like a cool one to build maybe even the vapid GB 200 um, I'm really I really don't know I mean if we could build that Mustang that I first saw for five hundred fifty thousand um, dollars not too exactly sure that's exactly what I want to do but I, I mean it might be fun it might be a fun build I've always wanted to do this one the drags the drag bike and then also the BF Raptor <laughs> looks kind of fun um, but I'm not I don't know when I'm gonna do one of those but maybe we could do like an older supercar uh, with a Roosevelt I've had uh, I remember back in the day they discontinued it and we did that so that was kind of cool but uh, the nightshade the nightshade would be a fun one we could do we could remake this one what's the difference between the two we got the Valor and then this one 750 what's the difference I wonder so that one hold they both hold six I don't understand what the difference is minus it's got a tire cover on it and white white uh, white walls huh oh I mean we, we could do it let's go old school want to 
I don't know why that one's 982, but for $200,000 more, I say let's do it. I say let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Let's go with the, let's just, uh, I guess we have to do it black, so, or we don't have to, but, you know what, let's see what the red looks like. Let's do it. 982,000 dollars and if i think oh my so we have whoo i'm gonna have to start grinding now whoo okay so that was it i think that's the vehicle we want to build um here i am staring at my uh, computer again but whoo this is gonna be this is gonna be interesting it's gonna be an expensive build too uh, i have a feeling so we're gonna probably i'm definitely gonna have to start grinding out now but i got a couple days because you know this is pre-recorded so if i start now i can almost remake that money so and it doesn't matter let's get to it i'll see you guys at the shop boom well here she is i didn't damage her too much but listen to this got the old style horns and she actually rose to sis but i what i was saying to myself earlier is how does it how do they make this nine hundred eighty two thousand when the other one is seven hundred fifty thousand and it's almost the same it's like the same vehicle but it's a collector's vehicle so that's what we're gonna do and that maybe that's what the title title of this video is and you could probably hear that dirt bike in the background but this is a collector so we bought it for seven hundred eighty two thousand dollars or no nine hundred and eighty two thousand dollars we could sell it for five hundred eighty nine million or yeah <laughs> Jesus that'd be awesome five hundred eighty nine thousand so let's see what we could do at the end of this so armor for sure speed this up really quick I'm gonna go quick and anything I take time on you know it's gonna be skipped but I think I have an idea of how I want to keep it and definitely the two lights in the front rear bumper uh, oh yes for sure because it didn't have that we'll stay the one yeah so we want to go we want to keep it like a collector's vehicle you know what I mean don't want to go too crazy arch covers oh, okay so we got oh Definitely arch cover, so you can do a lot. So that's what makes this nine hundred thousand dollars. It's got the vents, yes, that's old school. I like it. Got the horns. Oh, we can't hit the horns while doing it. But oh, what's that? So that adds lights, detail. No, I don't really. Oh, that's double. So let's get the best of both worlds there. Spare, dual spare. Uh, I don't like it being opened, and I don't like it secondary maybe I don't know oh okay I'd actually do like that I do like it so we got the badges oh that's the the top ornament I like that let's see oh that the oh yeah that's the bird the diamond wing I love it so now we got oh we got like little mesh grills in front of our headlights I like it love it freaking hood ornaments Yep, that's old school. So we're trying to make it as much as original as possible. Okay, so that's the side. Uh, we'll keep that off. I didn't care for that. Spare. We have to, How many spares do you need on these damn things? I don't... $10,000 for... Woo, for that. Uh, I don't know if we really need that. But you know what? It's a collector's. Might as well make it match. And that's it. That was it for the chassis. So engine, engine tune. Not sure exactly how much power this thing's gonna really have, but ooh. Okay, that's just like Rolls Royce status, so I don't really care for that. Oh, we're almost breaking into the ten million or the seven million dollar mark. That's not good being on the fourth vehicle. Let me just tell you. Let me just freaking tell you. So where are we at? Stock hood? Okay, no, we're not doing no freaking dragster, so none of that. We we don't need any of that. Horns, we'll keep the original horn it's got. Uh, honestly, we don't need the lights. Because if we do the lights, then that doesn't make it original. And then the plate, we're going to go black. Just to kind of shape things up a bit. And for the color, I'm undecided yet. We could sell it. So step plates... We could do the chrome, which, let's do it. Suspension. Lower this bad boy. 
I'm actually not too sure how these things sit stock. I think they sit pretty high, but let's just put the suspension on it. Transmission, the turbo, and we are not really officially in the 7 million yet. We're still in 8 million. This is cool. The wheels <laughs> freaking put some high end like bad boys on that thing. Nah, it's going to be uh, stock wheels. Maybe. Uh, what's the tuner look like? We might be able to get away with something. Nah, we got to have that white wall. Got to have the white wall. Wheel color we can't do, unfortunately, but we can add those. Tire design can't do, which is fine. Window tint, because we, we want to keep the original um, tires on there. It looks. I think it looks pretty well good. Pretty well good. That's what that, that makes sense. So that's it. So now we just have to respray it. And uh, I'm trying to, I didn't even think about this. What kind of, so we want to do classic. Uh, what color do we want to go with? What color scheme? Maybe a, uh, trying to think of one off the top of my head. Maybe a maroon, maybe? Oh, that looks, that looks good. Cab, carbonate red. And the next chrome. <laughs> that looks way too fancy. But we get oh, not the crew. Classic. Now, let's see what... Oh, wow, I just did it. How did I just come up with that kind of freaking scheme? Oh, dang, that looks good. Wine red. Oh, even that looks good. But um, Okay, I bought wine red, so that's probably the color we're going to choose. Unless the brown looks pretty good. Black. There we go, lime green. But no, that that red looks really good. So there's the browns. It looks decent. It looks pretty old school, but... Okay, no, well, we're sticking with that. Look at that beauty. That thing is so sweet. I love it. I actually really do like this. It's kind of a collector. So we bought it for $982,000. We can officially sell this thing for 713 So we took a huge, huge loss. That's like a... $400,000 loss and uh, oh and I almost sold it but that's it that's it fellas and this thing is so cool I really do love this vehicle right now wow and it okay so it doesn't really drift let's see if we, let's see if we get it to drift keep the tire spinning okay oh almost damaged her Okay, so right off the bat, you just punch it. That thing just rips. Does it drift pretty good? Okay, it doesn't drift, but it handles actually really great. I like it. This is probably going to hit the Instagram. So that's it. I'm not going to take it back to the garage. So if you did enjoy this freaking piece of art, such an amazing vehicle. I actually really do like it. This is my collector's edition. This is what we're going to call it. And uh, so if you did enjoy, please leave a like or anything down below. If you want to see a sneak peeks of other vehicles, follow me on Instagram. And as always, take care, stay tuned, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.